Where I'm standing right now is in Mission, Texas, in the Rio Grande Valley, but it's also the entranceway to the Cavazos family, longtime generational home. And they tell us how earlier just this week, they won their land back from the federal government that was scheduling to use this land right here to build more Trump-era border wall. They're not going to take our six and a half acres, so thank God. <laughs> Do you have plans? Are you going to start? <laughs> <laughs> Jose E. Cavazos' sister owns the land, Eloisa Cavazos, and after three years of fighting, it's officially hers again. Reynaldo Anzaldo, a cousin to Cavazos, says he is happy, but can't be too sure. But we have to be realistic, too. Uh, you know, what, what will happen if there's another administration, it's a Republican administration, what are they going to do? The emotions run high for the Cavazos family. They say, unlike many, they are native to this land. They hold a special love for their heritage. This this land here means a lot to the family because uh, this is land that our grandmother bought uh, and she told the family, you know, don't ever sell this land. Where I'm walking right now is where the wall was scheduled to be built and it would have been right in front of the entrance to their home. But the Texas Civil Rights Project, which represented the Cavazos family, says there's still work to be done, like halting the construction of the fencing that you see right next to me. Anzaldua says the construction of border wall altogether should end. They're saying that they're repairing the levees, but they're not repairing levees, they're, they're building walls. Cavazos says he doesn't see a need for more walls when he looks across the Rio Grande. What people? Nobody's crossing. Maybe at night one or two, but uh, as you see right now, this is the way it is almost every, all day, every day. Peaceful. The Texas Civil Rights Project says that the fight is not over yet, and there's a list of over 60 people still waiting to learn if their land will be condemned for border wall construction. In Mission, Texas, I'm Iris Karami. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to click on the red subscribe button below so you can get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.